Hey gang, so we're looking at uh, the Dark Valley and look at the Case Blue scenario and I told you guys that I was uh, setting this up uh, quite a while ago and so I wanted to uh, show you what the Soviet setup looks like. These are all the forces bar three mech cores that uh, tank cores that I found uh, that I forgot to put on the board. So I'm just clipping these guys real quick and we're going to put them on and in fact they will go on as a reserve uh, element probably up around Moscow. I have to set up fairly well north of all the action down in the southern part of the board down towards Rostov but uh, so be it. Now you got to have every uh, hex covered by a zone of control or by a unit that and that zone of control has to be generated by a unit that is on the uh, on the start line so uh, that's why you'll see some of the funky setups. So I do have a unit set back here, but uh, I've got zones control from here and here to cover this hex. Um, what else? Seems like an awful lot of units, but there's been a few uh, fact checking exercises going on and it would appear that we have all the accurate units we're supposed to have and don't have too many and all that sort of good stuff. So we'll see what happens from here. My biggest concern, of course, is that when you look at the center where all those red uh, uh, guards, divisions, or guards, armies are, or corps are, I should say, you know, all of these units here have uh, zones of control, which are just incredibly tough to break through. And uh, it's going to make the Moscow uh, lunge difficult, uh, but it certainly would make a, I don't know, maybe that, maybe I've got too much up there and I need to have more down in the south where I only have a handful of 5-4 units and I'll show you where they are with the zones of control right there. Uh, those guys are, are kind of blocking the, the route to the oil and we will hopefully manage to keep them keep this, the, the uh, Germans out of that area. I may reconfigure this a little bit before we get started and peel away some of the stronger units from the north and, and put them down to the south. So it really depends on where the Germans put their, their Schwerpunkt. Alright, so I'll show you that and we'll see what happens uh, once we get going and, uh, and get things cranking. And I'm also glad I did a double check actually. I'd already started filming this video and then I uh, was looking at the number of turns and realized that uh, uh, the reinforcements for both sides for turn 12 were also included in the uh, in the setup and that means that if I had started to play we would have missed the the uh, the Das Reich uh, would not have come into play and there goes my focus really having a hard time you can see the dust strike unit there. Well, you can see it in a, in a blurry kind of context. Go shoot yourself, dude. There we go. There it is. And we also uh, earn the, uh, the pick up on the GD as well across the Deutschland. So, two very substantial uh, divisions that would make uh, will make a big difference in the game. There's also a motorized. Uh, I'm a guy if I got a gross of Deutschland as well. Alright, talk to you soon guys.